A little over a year ago, President Trump sat down for an interview with Leslie Stahl, in which he complained that the Democrats and the deep state spied on his presidential campaign. And Leslie Stahl was having none of it. She said the charge was baseless. So the biggest scandal was when they spied on my campaign. They spied on my well, campaign. There's Leslie. no e real evidence of that. Of course there is. No. It's all over the place. Leslie, Sir, they spied on my campaign and they got I, caught. Can I say something? You know, this is 60 Minutes, and we can't put on things we can't no, verify. You won't put it on because it's bad for Biden. We can't Look, put on you. things we can't verify. Leslie, they spied and, on my campaign. Well, we can't verify that. It's been totally that. verified. No. No, 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 la, 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 no. This is 60 Minutes. La, this is totally crazy. You're a conspiracy theorist. How dare you make such a whoops, whoops, here it is. Turns out he was totally right. Totally 100% right. As of just a few days ago, we now have firm proof that not only did Hillary Clinton affiliates spy on Donald Trump when he was a candidate, but they even went so far as to spy on him when he was president, all in a desperate effort to frame him for colluding with the Russians. According to special counsel John Durham's latest DOJ report, quote, the government's evidence at trial will also establish that among the internet data tech executive one and his associates, uh, exploited was domain name system internet traffic pertaining to one, a particular healthcare provider, two, Trump Tower, three, Donald Trump's Central Park West apartment building, and four, the executive office of the president of the United States.